Hey Virgo, welcome to your January 23 career in finances. Guys, I hope that your new year is going amazing uh, so far. So let's check in and see what um, cards or what energy comes out for you uh, for your finances in January. Let's see, what do we have for Virgo spirit? Show Virgo the money, show Virgo the money. Show Virgo some guidance, life purpose. What we got? We got abundance, easy money. <laughs> okay, we got a feather here. This is abundance. This is money flowing in easily when it's supposed to come in, when it's needed, just for you, Virgo, because you are a doll. So you got spiral. So this is things, you know, maybe being out of control. So there could have been a situation for some of you where uh, things may have been you know, a little, little shady, you know, maybe you weren't so sure. Um, but it's also an energy here of, um, things moving up, uh, promotions coming in, uh, work being a little lighter. Uh, for some of you, it could be undecided about like where you should go or what you could do. But I feel like nevertheless, you're being guided to a place where, you know, uh, things are going to uh, be good for you. Uh, yeah. All right. What else? Some of you could have got um, some type of promotion here. Ooh, Buddha. Life purpose. More than money. Ooh, I like that. Interesting. So with Buddha here, Virgo, I feel like you guys are being guided uh, towards something because you got Buddha and you got the feather. And both of these cards to me represent guidance from the divine or from your higher self or whatever it is that you believe in. Some of you could be seeking careers in spiritual counseling or counseling others in, in, any, in any way, shape, or form. Maybe doing something a little lighter. Maybe for some of you, your job is a little heavy. And you're considering uh, switching it up because you have this spiral here. Maybe you may be seeing yourself uh, in a position where you may want to lighten the load just a little bit. So you're trying to make a decision on should you navigate from where you are, the job that you have, the position uh, that you're in to maybe do something a little, little lighter, maybe retirement uh, for some of you or a job that is going to lighten the load uh, just a little bit. Uh, maybe for some of you may feel like your life could be spiraling out of control, but I do feel like whatever it is that you're changing, whatever it is that you're being guided to do, which you may be a little undecided about right now, is going to make you feel better. It's going to lift some burdens, lighten some lows, and put you on a path that is more suited for you that definitely has to do with spiritual wealth, growth, abundance, and uh, even liberty. So you could be revisiting your thoughts when it comes to what you do for a living. And you may be hooking up with others that will help put you uh, in a place or a space or make the changes to do something just a little bit different. Yeah, heart. Something that maybe you like just a little bit more. Not that you're not content where you are, but I do feel like the universe is supporting you and guiding you into a career that you actually love. That'll be a little bit, uh, you know, just a little, a little happier. Lift up the load a little bit. Maybe you got a hard job and maybe it's not really what you want to do anymore. It's probably served this purpose for some of you. And now you kind of want to move on to something else. But I do feel like for some of you, you may be, un you may be undecided about exactly what that is. So let's see if we can get... Uh, some life purpose cards and see if we could get some messages from the universe to maybe help you figure out what it is that uh, you might want to do or maybe some clarification on what you think you should do and um, move towards that. So let's see, Virgo. You know, you want some easy money though. <laughs> I get it. You want some easy money. You want something that, you know, but some of you, yes, you just want something easier to do. And for others of you, your money's fine, but it's like you want um, something that's maybe more. It is just more than making money. It's more than a paycheck. So for some of you, it may, you know, what you should be doing right now may require you to travel. 
and then you have books here so for some of you like i said you could be spiritual teachers because buddha's here um it says connect to your life purpose through your involvement with books so some of you may be thinking about retiring and becoming a teacher maybe some of you are thinking about going back to school to switch your careers up you know maybe you don't like where you are and you want to do something you know that is it's like something more suited for you guys yep career change i knew you guys wanted to switch something up freedom yes you want something a little lighter for some of you and this is in support <laughs> you got support the universe is supporting you but i do feel like whatever it is that you are thinking about doing because you're definitely undecided undecided here for some of you you want to make sure that it, it will support you you just don't want to quit your job or go into something new whether it's your heart desire or not you still want to make sure that you can support yourself you want to make sure that your money is right and it allows you the freedom to go as you please, to vacation, you know, to have what you need and, and all of that stuff. So whatever this career change is, and I did feel that, and it look, I swear, you know, it says career change, it popped right out. I did feel like some of you wanted something new, something a little, just something a little lighter. You know, I do feel for some of you, your job may be a little stressful. Maybe you're in management. Uh, maybe you are... Um, you supervise others and um, maybe you just don't want to do that anymore. You want some, you want different. You want to connect to something different. <sighs> some of you are traveling though because you have the feather here and you have travel here. So if you're thinking about switching up careers, it may, you know, some of you may have found positions or been promoted to a position that is going to um, ask you to travel to do it. And for some of you, you don't want to, which is why you're looking for something that's just a little bit of light, a little lighter. Some of you could be traveling uh, for a living and maybe you kind of, although it may be bringing you the freedom and the support that you need, uh, I think you guys are looking into possibly like, what else can I do? Like, yeah, this, this, this job is definitely, you know, bringing me in what I want, but it's paying the bills, but is it really what I feel in my heart right now. Uh, is it really, am I really on my life purpose? Is is it taking me to a place, not just filling up my bank account, but is this job like supporting my emotional health, my spiritual health? Um, so I do see that uh, here for some of you. So let's see what else Virgo uh, we have. You want, you want more than money for some of you right now. And others of you, you just want some easy money. You want to lighten up the load. You want to do something different. You want to be free. But yet you want to have what you need. Yeah, you want to play. I just said you want to be free. You do. You want to be, you want something lighter. Oh, you guys, are you stressed? <sighs> yeah, it says you want to play. I know. I know you guys can feel like you just want a lighter load right now. You want to release something secret mm -mm. what is this what is this yeah so some of you could be thinking about you know wrapping something up maybe you're thinking about retiring maybe you're thinking about resigning you know whatever change that's what you're thinking about fucking change you're spending a lot of thought uh virgo trying to figure out exactly what it is that you want to do for yourself but you need it you got fortune on the bottom of the deck so that tells me that you know, you want to make sure that you got the money you need. So whatever change you make, you know, if you, you want to lighten a load, but you don't want to lighten, you know, your paycheck every week, which is facts, right? I know that's right. Facts. So you got wisdom and you have unlock. So you want to be smart about it, right? Because you don't want to put yourself, you know, in a place or in a space where you can't support yourself. You want to make sure that, you know, you look into everything, everything will unlock here you want to make sure that you assess the situation you know spend time and thought and meditation before you make these changes that some of you are actually trying to make here some of you could be thinking about going back to a job maybe that you worked before maybe returning back somewhere maybe at a job that was just a little easier for you or that you just liked a little bit more Hmm. All right, let's see what else we have here. Let's get some, let's see. What else for Virgo? Virgo, 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 Virgo. Um, I just, I just felt, maybe not for all of you, but I feel like for some of you, maybe, um, 
you may be in a space where things may seem like um, it's a little heavy on you and you want to release this. Um, you got 66 that came out and it says, um, I am positive. So if you guys have, if you're in a, a job or career or a space that it seems like things are kind of, you know, out of your control, maybe you feel like you're stuck a little bit, know that you are not. You got seven here and that says, I am brilliant. Like follow like your heart, follow what you're your higher self is telling you to do. Follow your life purpose. Don't let, you know, jobs and money and stuff consume you. Uh, be mindful uh, of sacrificing your happiness, you know, for money. And that's not for everybody, but uh, the universe is kind of coming in here and trying to redirect some of you to put you in a, in a place where you have more freedom. There is a career change here for you, period. And again, like I said before, it's going to put you in a place where you may be able to unlock, you know, maybe parts of yourself that you haven't seen in a long time. For some of you, could have been working, you're working so god darn much that you're not even, you know, spending time in relationships or, you know, uh, spending time with yourself. Or when you are spending time with yourself, I mean, you're, you're all in your head, you're, worried, you're being wise and you're handling your money and you're handling your finances, it seems quite well, but are you, are you bringing in peace and love and joy? Or, and, you know, are you playing enough? Are you hiding like in, in your career and not really uh, evolving in other areas uh, of your life, Virgo? And some of you feel like that. You know, things are getting out of control. You got 22. I'm aligned. Yeah. You know, you may need that. You want to align yourself. You want your heart and your work space to be in alignment uh, with each other. You want to be doing something that, that you love. Hmm. Okay. Okay, let's see what else we have here for you, uh, Virgo. I'm trying to think, guys, like, I do feel a divine intervention here. So I think some of you are, there's something tugging on you. You're undecided about something. You're trying to figure it out. Yeah, it has to do with business, of course, because this is a, this is a career move here. This is a career reading. But, um... Some of you, if you got a promotion, I'm not sure if you want it. You may have accepted the promotion because it's going to bring you finances, it's going to bring you money, but I don't feel like it's going to allow you free time. So you may be reconsidering this, maybe going back to an old position that you had. If you accepted this position already, maybe backtracking and saying like, look, this this really this is like 10 cards. It ain't happening. Um, maybe this position isn't really for me. Yeah, you got new money here. So for some of you, you did get, you got some type of uh, increase here. For some of you, I, I, it could have been a, some easy money. Got something that came in for you guys. It's going to work better for you. But there is a, a very slow, heavy energy here that for some of you it's not if you got a new position that's going to allow you like a career change that's going to like allow you more freedom allow you more time to play you know more time to spend like maybe you know having some tea reading some books like really sitting back and putting your feet up definitely for some of you that's that's definitely could be here uh and and this money that's coming in it's new and it's easy uh for others of you not so much i feel like your work life is getting out of control and you need to get in alignment with your life purpose because your job is consuming you. So it says new money, something new you've been working on will be profitable. You should consider creating a new source of income. If you have a money making idea, then do it. So uh, yeah, Virgo, if there's something that you are thinking about doing, maybe, you know, hanging up that old nine to five and maybe opening up you know, a restaurant or a business for yourself, by all means, do it. I was thinking about that recently, you know, 
Uh, you got unexpected here. Mm, okay, guys. So for some of you, I don't know why I feel like, and I'm not being a pessimist here, but I do feel like some of you have had it. <laughs> I don't know. I feel like for some of you, you want to break away. And you're thinking about this a lot. Like, yo, I'm tired of this. This is not what I want to do. I don't feel like this job is it's supporting me financially, but it ends there. I have no life. I have no friends. I have no kids. It's just me. You know, all I'm doing is working and thinking, working and thinking, working and thinking. Or if you're working at work, then you go home and you work some freaking more. But something for some of you has happened with this unexpected here and this spiral. Something that has, is, is if it hasn't happened already, it will be coming towards you. It says, prepare for the unex unexpected financial loss. This crisis may be out of your control. Yeah, there is something that's out of your control here, uh, Virgo. Hmm. It says this financial crisis may be out of your control, but you can still control the outcome. Deal with things head on and try to prepare for the unexpected before it happens. So some of you maybe end up having to find a new job. There may be something that rolls in unexpected, but I feel like if it does, Virgo, then it's going to put you on your life purpose. It's going to free you up so that you do have more time to travel, more time to play, more time to spend, you know, with your family or actually get into a relationship for the life of you. You know, for some of you, you spend so much time, you know, focusing on your mistakes so much time focusing on you know your work and being like excelling in that area and you do a good job but like i said um or maybe i didn't uh sometimes the universe will come in and hand us these unexpected moments uh this one i don't know if i showed you the unexpected this unexpected shit right here to come in and shake us into a place where we can live our lives you know you work too god darn much you know and that's just that's the energy that i'm feeling here you need to lighten the load so lighten your load, Virgo, before do it yourself. Because if you don't do it, then the universe is going to do it for you. And it definitely does it slightly different than what we normally have in mind. You know, it probably stings a little bit when we, excuse me, have towers and stuff that come in. Pardon. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, let's see what else comes out here. Oh, that's a lot. That's like half the day. We're going to put those back. Uh you know this is coming. You can feel it. For some of you, I don't know. I, I can feel it like breakdown. <laughs> I can feel it. But I just like break down, break down, break down. You know, you're working yourself too much or something is crumbling right now when it comes to your career. So you got a promoter. So there's new ideas here. You have an idea. You know what you want. But I just feel like you're just not heading in that direction. It says be a sport. And we have angelic help. Mm -hmm. So I do feel that you're being guided. And I said that earlier, like with angelic help here. I do feel like you're you're being guided. And with promoter and be a sport here, um, you focus too much on being a team player. I, I, I don't know. I know that sounds kind of messed up to say, you know, when you're at work, you want to do the best job that you could possibly do. But I feel like you do it so well that you just, you know, you 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 invest a lot in others, Virgo. You do your job by the book, you know, you're there on time, you're kind and courteous to your coworkers, customers, you know, but when it comes to uh, doing things for you, you suck, you know, and not all of you, but some of you. I feel like you should promote, you know, and invest more into yourself with promoter here. Some of you, you could be in uh, the business with uh, promotion or the industry um, in some way, shape or form. And, you know, you go above and beyond. But I do feel an energy here of burnout, things spiraling out of control and you needing something new. Uh, promoter says there is a new idea or project manifesting. No, it has great potential for success. You have two energies here with you, um, promoting or, you know, new ideas. You got new money here and you got promoter here. So there's something new that you're being nudged to do. Go do it. <laughs> Go do it, Virgo. Careers in the nightlife industry, events or restaurant industry could be right for you. I was just, did I say that earlier about the restaurant, like doing a restaurant? Because I, I I know personally I was uh, 
you know, um, had a childhood memory of this of this uh, rib joint that used to be uh, in Chicago, and it was called Freddy's. And he had the best rib tips. Like seriously, the fucking sauce was like off the chain. And he would, you know, chop them up in little pieces of ribs, and then he would. Uh, put them over like a bed of french fries and I always like mine spicy so he put like hot pepper seeds that shit was good I just tear that shit up you know and so I was like god I would love to have a joint like that you know I don't know if, you know if that place is still open but I know me and my sister and uh, my mom would uh you know go there every now and then it was like such a treat but I I don't know I, for some of you I feel like and where am I going with this because I had the thought earlier of restaurant so I don't know if some of you Virgo are thinking about opening up restaurant spots or something, but that memory, that 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 thought is in my head. So if you're thinking about doing this, you have help. Do this, you know. Release the shackles from whatever your nine to five is right now, or whatever it is that you're doing, and follow your freaking dreams. Because I know you feel like you can do it. It's just that for some of you, you just don't have maybe the the, maybe someone encouraging you. I am feeling that. And not that you necessarily need anybody to encourage you, but it fucking helps, you know, to have someone promoting you in your corner, encouraging you like, hey, Virgo, you can do it. You can do it. You can do it. Because you spend a lot of time doing that for others. I ain't gonna talk your ear off, you know, about this, but um, the card does, says, use, does say, use the law of attraction for money. Be the energy you want to attract. If you want it, Virgo, go get it. If you need to let something go before this spirals out of control and stresses you the hell out, if you need something a little easier to do, something a little lighter to get into because you want to spend some time uh, alone or you want to spend some time traveling, reading, you know, and things like that, you did have support here. And again, you know, if you don't have it from physical beings, uh, Virgo, you definitely have it from the angelic world. Support is here for you. So it's okay to stop what you're doing, right? You've been a sport long enough. It's time to support your fucking self. It's time to support yourself, Virgo. Do what is best for you. Stop working yourself so freaking hard, man. Because honestly, it has its rewards, right? You're helping others. You're contributing to society, Virgo. But help your goddamn self. Like, make you happy too in the process. So... Um, if you, if this is, you want to open up a restaurant, uh, that's too many cards. If you want to open up a restaurant or, um, or if you want to go into some type of spiritual work, do it. You got rescuer here. Like I said earlier, rescue yourself. <laughs> Seriously. Stop rescuing others. It's okay to serve people, but now I feel like there's an energy here for you to serve yourself. Period. You got media. Some of you could be in the media because you got promoter here too. So some of you could work in, like I said, the industry of, um, I don't know, television. Uh, you could be on the news or work in some type of uh, entertainment or uh, something that has to do with that. But um, do some research. Uh, go online. Look up how to start my business. How to start, you know, a, a career of spiritual counseling or how to open up my own restaurant, like use the resources that you have, you know, read books, watch TV, do whatever you is, whatever it is that you need to kind of set you on a path. So it says step into the spotlight and get seen. Don't allow your talent to go unnoticed. A career in television, radio, magazine, or any mass media job might be perfect for you. It might be the time to get more public, more publicity if you want to increase your finances. So for those of you, Virgo, who want to get into the media, it's here for you because you got promoter here. And that's definitely like in the, <laughs> in the media. So this may be a message for those who are in the media or wanting to be in the media. And if this is what you want to do, go get it. Oh, look at this. Spirit says success will find you. Exactly. It's coming because you're being guided here. So whether you want this or not, whether you decide to switch to, 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 to take this career change, uh, Virgo, if you don't do it willingly, the universe is going to help you. <laughs> so in the end, it'll be for your highest good. So Virgo, uh, sending you love, light and blessings. Please like and subscribe and I will see you guys in the next video.